back to the real chat. We're uh, talking to Pete Lawrence here at Kicking Home Inspection. So, Pete, tell us a little bit about you know what someone should do uh, if they're preparing their home for uh, for a home inspection. I mean, are there for any a home tips? inspection, the first thing I would say is listen yeah. to your agent. Okay. If you're the seller and the, your agent recommends that you open up the crawl space and the basement so that the home inspector can get to the main water shutoff valve, the furnace. So they have access to all the various components of the house. That's important. If you've got a bunch of stuff piled underneath the attic hatch, I'm going to want to see in the attic hatch. And if you were the buyer, you'd want me to look in the attic hatch. So if you're the seller, definitely open your home up so that we can get into the places we need to. Okay. So basically full access to all the mechanicals, yes. all the areas of the home. Very important. Okay. Anything the second thing else? I'd recommend is, is to go around and do the basic maintenance on the home. Mm -hmm. But don't do it for to try to cover stuff for the home inspector. Do it because the house needs it. Mm -hmm. It's more important that the house be maintained properly than to try to do it covered up for the home inspector. As an inspector, I will be able to see through most of the stuff that has been done to cover up defects. Gotcha. So don't try to cover up defects. Got it. So they're putting on the market, hey, if you know something's leaking, fix it. Fix the leak. Right. Don't just fix the <laughs> drywall that shows the leak. <laughs> right. <laughs> yes. Fair enough. So are there anything else that would be a, you know, a tip for, for sellers? If you're not familiar with home maintenance and how to take care of your home, it might be a good idea to get a home inspection before you list it for sale. Hmm. This an ins professional inspector will come through and give you, generate a list of things that you should be doing to your house. And this will help when they get the house under contract because the next buyer's inspection won't have that same list of items. It will right. make the buyer much more comfortable in moving forward with the transaction. Yeah, I think that's a, that's a great tip for, for folks um, to get a pre-inspection done prior to putting a home on the market. Yeah, yeah great idea. It really can smooth out the transaction. Yeah, I would agree. Well, again, thanks for uh, taking some time out of your schedule. I uh, appreciate those who viewed this, uh, this uh, edition of uh, Real Chat, and we'll talk to you next, uh, next time. See ya.